All right, today we're going to play something extremely relaxing since we just got done playing for a whole month straight Final <laughs> Fantasy VII, and we need something easy. It did feel like a month, yes. Is this a new game? Okay, yeah, it should be new. Welcome to Game Dev Tycoon. In this business simulation, you have been transported back in time to start your very own game development company right at the beginning of the PC revolution. In the next 35 years, you can build your dream company, create best-selling games, gain fans, and become the leader of the market. Yeah. And you have a DeLorean. <laughs> Before... I was going to read that. <laughs> I turned down a little bit. Before you can start your adventure, you have to give your upcoming company a name. Cheese Dick Incorporated? Or Joystick Studios, since we're together at the Joystick. Uh, that makes sense. <laughs> no, it's better than Cheese Dick. It is, yeah. <laughs> no, please no. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> What's our player name? Uh, it's up to you. As generic as they come. <laughs> yep. We are John Doe. <laughs> Since you've played the game before, you can choose to use all the previously gained hints in this new game. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, we've played a lot. A lot of these looks like a are glitch or something. Oh yeah, they all say year one, month one, week one, and zero fans. Yeah, I know I have way more than that. Yeah, because we've both separately played this game and beat it multiple times. We'll just cancel that. Did I screw it up? Now you got to start over. <laughs> oh man. No. Maybe the game glitched out or something. Must have. Well, so anyways, uh, we actually played this. Obviously, we played this game a long time ago. This game came out like 10 years ago, I think. And uh, we love it. It's mm -hmm. kind of a guilty... I don't know if a guilty pleasure game, but I sure as hell love it. I do too. Let's develop our very first game. Let's name it last after we pick the topic, genre, and platform. That's a good point. Ooh. Aliens? Aliens. That's exactly what I was thinking. Uh, action? Action. PC. It's about neck to neck right now. What should we call our first mm. alien game? UFO? Just UFO? Yeah, it would sell. In the Cheese Dick Battalion. <laughs> All right. We're going to make our very first blockbuster right here. That's right. What should we do? Oh, no. Gameplay should be the top. Yeah. Don't you think? Who cares about the story and quest? You want a good <laughs> engine, you want good gameplay. Yeah. Level design. Definitely an AI. Yeah. There you go. Sounds good to me. <laughs> I've got some bugs. Uh, world design. Mm -hmm. Graphics. Graphics. Sounds kind of like not a big deal back in the day. Right. I do have a mouse I get, she can use as well, but it's it, it was dead. It's charging right now. Let's get that last bug. There we go. Oh, we got oh, another. No, oh, one more bug. We fix the bug and cause another bug. I've done that before in real life. <laughs> I create games for fun, and it happens. 
UFO is ready. It's gonna be a smash hit. Ooh, the first reviews are in. Ah, can't please everybody. <laughs> Could have been better. <laughs> Tough critic. Nice. Oh, come on, all games. Eh, not bad for your very first game. True. Joystick Studios, a newcomer in the game industry, has just released their first game, UFO. The game received favorable reviews. Well, there's not much else to do besides let's make... New game. Or how about a game report? Oh, okay. <laughs> wow, got to start somewhere. <laughs> I love that in the movie Due Date where he's like, um, I have 50 fence friends on <laughs> Facebook. Some of them are pending, but I have 50 friends. <laughs> nice. Graphics seems to be very important. Well, didn't we focus on graphics? Yeah. I think so. Definitely a history game. Awesome. I was Simulation. Thinking, like so you a, can make like Civ. Like, yeah, I was thinking like Civ, yeah. What should we call it? Hmm. Civilized. Civilized. <laughs> nice. It's not a ripoff, I promise. <laughs> I know it punishes you if you like do too many of the same games at once. Yeah. Over again. Yeah. Yes. Gameplay is the most important. Yep. You gotta have good gameplay in your not civilization. <laughs> Yep. Oh, but you want your AI to be good so that, like, the other countries, you know? Who cares about level design and a strategy game like that? You want good art, AI, yeah. good computers. Yes. Maybe a little bit of dialogue. You know, when Gandhi threatens to nuke the world. Mm -hmm. That type of deal. Uh, sounds. Yeah, yeah. Graphics is probably the most important thing. Yeah. And. World design is pretty important if you, yeah. Yeah. I guess we're in agreement there. Which is good, because for the last month we've been playing Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We have not agreed on anything. <laughs> oh, you didn't wait and get all the bugs out. Oh, darn, you're right. UFO is now off the market. Yeah, we did have a bit of change in a difference of opinion a when lot. it came to Final Fantasy. Yeah, I wanted uh -oh. to explore more. Uh oh. Oh. Civilize is uh, it's a stinker. <laughs> 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 we made a stinker. Uh oh. Uh, it's okay. It happens. Uh, falls a bit short. Meh. Well, what'd we do wrong? Let's figure it out. This game is so chill. Mm-hmm. Gobador. Not to be confused with the Commodore 64. It's definitely not the Commodore. <laughs> Maybe we had too many bugs. Mm -hmm. I was being impatient. I had to earn the rent this month, you know? <laughs> Well, we did right on those. I think it's just bad experience. Yep. Now let's do extreme sports. All right. The action? Action. Yeah. Uh. Tony Eagle. <laughs> <laughs> Tony. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not Tony Hawk. <laughs> <laughs> Tony Eagle Pro Skater. No, no, no. Let's do uh, Bam Margera. 
Oh, there skater. you go. <laughs> or rehab skater. Not, not so pro skater. <laughs> rehab skater. I like that better. Rehab. <laughs> I'm sorry. I love Bam. I love Bam too. We are huge Jackass I, we fans. We are huge Jackass fans. I really want him to get better. I'm not making fun of him. I love him. And I did that with love. <laughs> we did that with love. <laughs> I think you're about the same, don't you think? Yes, I agree. <laughs> Bam Marjara, rehab <laughs> skater. <laughs> if this becomes our series that we make sequels with every new Yeah, thing. <laughs> we'll have like 10 of these bad boys. Got a little bit of dialogue, I guess. Um, level design. You got to have good mm -hmm. level design. There we go. Who cares about the AI? <laughs> we don't need no damn chat chat GPT. Nope. According to rumors, the Japanese company Nintendo <laughs> is planning to launch its very own home gaming console. Nintendo is known for the wildly <laughs> successful arcade game Dinky King. Dinky King. <laughs> um, you want to see my Dinky King? <laughs> Many industry experts doubt that home gaming consoles will take off, but are eager to see what Nintendo will deliver. Nintendo. <laughs> we'll just say like the proper names. It's hurting my head. Oh, look at that. Okay. Because we have some prior knowledge. Yes, we have so some hints. You want a lot of graphics. You definitely want graphics. It's super important. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. No, no bugs. bugs. No bugs. Zero <laughs> bugs. People are going to love Bam Margera Rehab Skater. <laughs> it's going to be great. They're going to love it. Come on. The first reviews for our newly released game, Bam Margera my, Rehab my Skater, is in. My heart's racing. <laughs> Come on, bam. Ah, shows potential. Meh. Aww. Aww. Not everyone's a fan of Bam Margera, I guess. <laughs> we did them wrong. We'll try again in the future. We'll try again. We'll make a we'll make a sequel on like Nintendo. It's kind of hard to make a game that's a hit like this early in the stage. It is. It's always good to do the reports because then you'll know. Yeah, yeah, and it gives you hints for next time. Yeah. Do contract work down there. I don't do contract work. Oh. I, I really, I, re I release games, hit after hit. Okay then. Today, Nintendo has confirmed recent rumors and announced their plans to release a new gaming console called TES early this year. Next year, the console features cartridge-based games and a uniquely designed controller. Our nice. game report is ready. Nice. <laughs> Story quest seems to not be important. I figured that one. Nice. So we're doing we're doing the right we're doing way. Doing good. Yeah. Oh, should we do some research? Yes. Let's do a new topic. Rhythm. Rhythm. That way we'll be hot and fresh. Yeah. With something exciting and new. We haven't done one thing though. I know we uh, we missed a topic earlier. It's yeah, we haven't done mythology yet. Yeah, it's random. Aw. You're welcome. I love you guys. Your game's awesome. Mm -hmm. I hope so. <laughs> you rock too, Patrick and Daniel. Nice. Much love. Your game kicks ass. Yes. Okay. New topic. Rhythm. Genre. Hmm. Rhythm games are action, aren't they? I guess so, yeah. Platform. PC. We'll call it... Dance. Uh, no. Come on. Help me out here. Um. Oh no. 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 Not a fan. Not a fan. Okay. Boot scootin' boogie. Boot <laughs> scootin' <laughs> boogie. Boot scootin' boogie. There you go. 
I like that. Good job, co-creator Jane Doe. <laughs> Jane and John Doe. Uh, gameplay. Gameplay. Yes. That's about right, I would think. Sometimes I like to kind of slightly sludge it. I mean, I mean yeah, not sludge it, yeah. but nudge it if the last game didn't do very well. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot how fun this game is. It is so much fun. I, I kind of did too. Well, sometimes yeah. we like you get into it, it's like sucks you in. Yes, it does. And before you know it, it's like 12 o'clock at night. Yes. Uh, Dialogue can go down a little. Yeah, it can go down all the way. Wouldn't it just be like level design? I think so. Hey, we have positive cash flow, so that's all that matters. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pam Margera is now off the market. That's the <laughs> truth. Sound. <laughs> Graphics a little bit. World design, no. Yep. Perfect. You want good sound. In this period, this is like during like the Tetris era. Mm -hmm. It's not going to be a very good looking game. Today, the game platform TES by Ninvento has been released. Oh, we should make a Ninvento game. I was going to say next we should research um, being able to make games for the Nintendo. Yeah. At least we're getting experience. Ooh. Maybe we can start researching some cool stuff now. Boot scoot and boogie. <laughs> I'm gonna laugh if one of like our biggest hit games is something stupid. <laughs> Aww. Uh, we forgot about AI. We went too far in certain places. I guess so. It's meh. Middle of the road. Meh. That's okay. Game report. Rhythm and action is a great combination. AI seems to be very, very important. important. Whoa, okay. we made that like dead last. Whoops. Game engine. That's custom game engine, but we, we have anything to... Oh, I thought that meant I think we that we can develop for Nintendo. Is that not what that means? Hold on. Maybe there is something we can do. I forgot. Me too. There's a way to develop like new stuff new sound engine and stuff like that, but I don't know if we have anything we can do yet. Game tutorials and mono sound. Okay. Okay, so now can we do it? Yeah, let's take a minute to get some research done. We, we need better games. Yeah. Work your butt off, John, before we can hire anybody. <laughs> you can get more in greater studios. Stuff like that. Game tutorials. Oh, well, I don't know for RP. I guess we'll have to do some more game development. Okay. Right? Yep. Do you have to create the engine now that we have the sound? I don't, I don't remember. It's been a while. Uh, we haven't done mythology yet. Sure. Adventure, maybe? Oh, oh for the TES. The TES. Ooh. What's That's a lot of money. Do it? Yeah, I would do it. We're gonna, oh, no, 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 we gotta name it. We're gonna take a gamble. <laughs> we don't wanna name it game number five. <laughs> I was just thinking Medusa. Medusa's, Medusa's Revenge. That's what I was thinking. Hey, get out of my head. Nice. I think you have to have the engine made before you. Uh oh. Uh oh. We're in the red. Gotta spend money and make Story money. Story and quest should be number one, I think. About right there? Yeah. Our bank account's looking really scary. It's okay. We'll release this game and it's going to be a hit. Maybe not. 
Yeah, we have to have a new engine before we're allowed to use that. Darn it. Okay. Um, world design. And graphics. graphics. Yes. I agree. Get rid of those bugs. Oh. Okay. Come on, game. Don't let me down. Like right, negative forty six thousand dollars. Well, I guess it wasn't a total loss. It's <laughs> quirky, but good. Quirky, but good. <laughs> okay. okay. Can't please everybody. Maybe since it's like a new system, it might get a little bit... Oh, we made money. Thank goodness. Yeah, it might make some money since it's new and the hot thing on the market. Mythology, mythology Adventure is okay combination. Level design seems not to be very important. Platform, genre, match, TES, Adventure, bad. Okay. So that was just an all-around just... Crap. <laughs> New engine will have 2D graphics. We can't afford to make a new engine right now. Oh, yeah, true. Okay. Contract work. We got to do it. We got to make a little bit of money so that we can do stuff. Oh, so boring. <laughs> the recently released uh, TES home console has proven to be a massive success. I love the games that come with TES and playing with the controller is so much more fun than on a keyboard. <laughs> Contract work is so boring. Yeah, but we needed a little bit of cash flow. <laughs> Again. Let's do an aliens on the Nintendo. And make it uh, action? Uh huh. Yeah, it's telling you which ones it's not good. Adventure's bad. Adventure's bad. No, name it. What should we name it? Neptune men. <laughs> sure. With our crappy engine that is like really just boring. Yeah, we do need to make an engine next, probably. Usually the game is like a, um, it's a grind until you get that first hit and then yeah. you make a massive amounts of money. Yep. It's like super duper important. Okay. Yeah. Maybe like right there? Yeah. Now we have a tip. Uh, can you look at that contract work to see the message? Jason here. Just got word from the client that the contract was completed successfully. Excellent work. And nice. Jason's Revenge sold 15,000 units, 100,000 in sales. We're Graphics, still, super important. We're still negative, though. Oh, thanks. I forgot to click on it earlier. <laughs> I like money. Our uh, our rent must be really high down here in this basement because, wow, <laughs> we're bleeding money. <laughs> 
Come on. Nice. Come on, Neptune men. Yeah, we have no money. I can't do custom engines. <laughs> I got no moolah. No moolah. No moolah. Ooh, oh, I, I saw an eight. Ah. Uh, hey. We made a game that's actually enjoyable. Oh, wow. Oh. I saw a 10. Oh. Hey. People like Neptune men. They like Neptune. They really like us. They really like it. <laughs> it's very good. Very, very good. Very good. I played it for days. Nice. Now Damn we right. can make enough money to make an engine. Yep. Let the money roll in. Oh, yeah. We're, yep. We're making money now. There's rumors that Vena, which is not Sega, another Japanese company, <laughs> is planning to release a home gaming console on their own. I thought it meant Sony, but I think you're right. Probably you don't, Sega. You don't have to do all the systems, though. I usually stick to my like my like preferred system. Me too. That way I can learn what's best on them. Yeah. Okay. It is okay. Okay. Custom engine. First, let's see if we can research some stuff. Gotta have game tutorials. Let's get all the stuff researched and then we'll make our engine. Because okay. otherwise you have to make the engine over and over again. It's a waste of money. That's true. Good point. Hey, look at our money. You could use this other mouse, but it's the ball mouse. No, I don't like that. Uh, research. Hey, look at that. It's the master system. <laughs> The Master V is technically superior to the massively successful TES, but it doesn't ever catch on as much. So let's stick with Nintendo. Yep. And that two minutes off the market. It Ooh, ooh yeah. $200,000. And we have a new engine. Fix and do. And we're gonna call it, what should be our engine? We'll have like a like a whole series of engines. And we'll oh, definitely. Going. What do you want to call it? The badass engine. <laughs> vroom vroom. Vroom vroom. <laughs> vroom vroom. Version 1.0. Nice. You can you can save your game. It's linear. It has tutorials and mono sound. And that's all our money. Are you sure? That's 150 thousand. Yeah, you gotta have a good engine. Okay. Vroom vroom. <laughs> But you're right, though. We're going to be broke here. Need another smash hit. You know, Ma uh, Daddy always said, shit ain't cheap. <laughs> After this, let's research a new topic. And then make a game. That costs money. We need to, like, cash out, like, now and start making a game, like, pronto. Okay. Vroom Vroom, version 1.0. Ooh. Topic. Um, we could do a rhythm game for the NES. We haven't done one yet. I don't know if rhythm works good for NES. We can try. We'll make it everyone. Genre. Action. You want to do an RPG? I bet that'd be good for Nintendo. Sure. Not rhythm. Though. Not rhythm. We'll make it. History. Aliens, and we'll call it um, father, like opposite of mother. Well, Is no, mother again? earthbound. Yes, yeah, based on earthbound. Earthbound's mother, so we'll call it uh, moonbound. There we go. Okay. And we'll make it on TES. Vroom vroom 1.0, and it's for everyone. Oh, there goes a lot of money. Yep. Oh, we have a new engine. Uh, that's going to put us, yeah, bankrupt. Ooh, okay. Well, options we are got a bailout, but yeah. <laughs> okay, so story and quest should be... Oh, gosh, babe. Oh. You're doing too much. I think we're gonna, you're going to make us go bankrupt. Can we just get more money? No, like, 
they gave us a bailout, but we have to pay back 160000 within a year. But we can't use our engine that we have. It's so sad. I think that's Store, good. Wait, wait, wait. Story and quest should be, like, top. There we go. Good? Yeah. I don't know why this game was so hard at first. Did you struggle this much at first? Or is that, or I just suck that bad? No, I think it's, it's supposed to be this hard at first. Yeah, good dialogue, right? Mm -hmm. Good level design. Yep. Good AI. If this game doesn't do well, we're gonna have to do a lot of contract work for a while. Uh, yes. <laughs> Let's spend a little more money and get the mono sounds at least. Okay. Come on now. Maybe like that. Sure. Sega's not doing very good. Come on, baby. How about the edge of your seat? If this game doesn't do well, we're like... In bad trouble. We're looking for jobs at Taco Bell. <laughs> oh, look at that tin. Oh, look at that tin. Oh. Oh, 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 yeah. It's going to be a hit. It's going to be a hit. Okay, we did good. Oof. They achieved a great balance between technology and design. Oh, come on. What's up with that guy? <laughs> Give me a 10. 10, 10. Well, Star, Star hey. Games like it. That's going to be a good one. We never recovered from that license, the deal with Nintendo. We also were in debt too, by the way, still. We owe like the bank money. Yes. Let's don't get cocky here. That's true. Awesome. Graphics are important. It's okay. Good. Okay, so we did a good. Did good. Yeah, good comments. It's a surprise hit with players. The developer. It's fairly new to the game industry, but we cannot wait for what they develop next. Awesome. New topic. We do hunting, time travel. Sports? Sports is good. So we can make a Nintendo baseball game? Yeah, we could do that. And we use our best that our engine has to offer. Because so we don't have to be so cheap now. Yeah. Everyone. And we'll do pick, uh, sports, genre, action, mm -hmm. platform. And yes, I'm going to call it a... Super Steroids. Baseball. <laughs> <laughs> vroom vroom. Nice. I want to play Super Steroids Baseball. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Gameplay has got to be like the best. It's, Story and it's quest two pluses Lolo. though. It's not three. So I want to say if it's two, we'll keep it like right around here. Okay. Story is negative. So let's like, who cares? Let's just dump that way down there. Yeah. And then, uh, we don't need that. Nope. Save game would nice. Yes. And game tutorials. Yes. Let's just play with common sense. I don't I don't want to be gamey here. I don't care about like min maxing. Let's just do what we think is sounds yeah. legit. Ooh, 50,000 units. Nice. Casual cool. games. That'd be good like for uh, <laughs> for super steroids baseball. Uh oh. Goodbye, Commodore. Going bye bye. So we know this is three pluses. So let's crank that up. Mm -hmm. Dialogue, no. Uh, graphics. Crank that up. World design all the way negative. 
Look at you. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Moonbound's off the market. Nice. Made $370,000, give or take. Let's get rid of those bugs. Super Steroids Baseball. It sounds like a really fun game. Yes, it does. <laughs> Let's see if it's going to be our smash hit that puts us on the map. <laughs> I'm, there's always that one game that puts you on the map. What's it going to be? And once I do it, it will have, like make forever sequels. make it's like our Final Fantasy. Yes. Today, Nintendo has announced that they will introduce a portable gaming device called GameLink. The device comes with changeable game cartridges, a monochrome screen <laughs> on, a, on a green background, built-in speakers, and even multiplayer support via connection cable. When, I, when my, my friend Greg got that for the first time, I could barely see the damn screen. Oh, yeah. I was like, how do you, I can't see Mario, man. <laughs> I had a yellow Game Boy Color. I never had the gray one. No, my friend had like the original. Nice. We may make a Game Boy game. We'll see. Super, I got a couple of tens there. Hey! They like Super Steroids Baseball. They love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's very, well, yeah, it's very enjoyable. Of course it is. These guys are hard to impress down here. Mm -hmm. If we get a 10 from all games, we're, it's just, I, can, I can just retire. Yep. We'll never get better than that. Action good. Level design seems to not be important, which we knew that. Yep. Come on, research. Casual games. Oh yeah, we're like half a million dollars. We're doing good now. Yep. We can focus. Like we we struggled there for a bit because we made some really questionable decisions. Yeah. Game Boy is out. Let's research better user experience. If you keep doing this, you'll get better reviews. Yeah. You can't just stay with the same engine forever. I usually make a new engine after I've learned a new um, system. Uh, we we should be good. We yeah. have we have like you know quadruple that amount. We'll just take it easy. So we will. Um, new topic. Well, we need to create the new engine. Are you sure? that's all you get that's different that's true well, yeah that's true that's, that's a lot of money yeah I'd wait wait until we have more stuff mm -hmm. we can do school or thief or hunting we can do hunting or time travel we can do duck hunt let's do hunting and that would be yeah we make our own version of duck hunt yeah with a light gun game I used to, I have. we still have it we have our gun and it still works you have to use the CRT, though. It doesn't work on modern TVs. Uh, okay, so let's develop a new game. Everyone. Call it Goose Hunt. Or Mallard Hunt. <laughs> you spell Mallard. Is it two L's? I think so. A-R-D. Like that? Yeah. Sure. I'll Google it to make sure. Google! Sure. Hot Google. Google! Can your heart stand? Hot Google action! <laughs> uh, hunting... Yeah, I had it right. Action. Uh, Nintendo, I don't think it would go good on a uh, game handheld. Mm, probably not. Vroom, vroom, one, one. All right. Mallard Hunt. We'll have a story with Mallard Hunt. <laughs> <laughs> Gameplay is too... Lower that a little bit. Engine. Maybe crank that up a tan kind of experiment it's kind of funny learn as you go and trying to make small adjustments mm -hmm. level design still too I guess we can do a little bit more oh, 
Honestly, that should be fine. We know from experience. You can become like a Hideo Kojima type developer. We always do the same type of games over and over again, but you could, might but get boring. yeah. Some small adjustments there. Have we paid back our loan yet? I don't think so. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, there goes 150,000. But hey, they bailed me out. That's cool, bro. Yep. It's fine. It's fair. New record. Level editor. Mallard Hunt has come in. 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, on, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. Oh, we got our first 10. Mallard Hunt is our hit. <laughs> it's our hit. Can't wait for the sequel. Oh, you'll get a sequel. All right. Oh, yeah. We'll on cut. Super Nintendo. 10, two 10s. Oh, nice. And Game Hero is really hard to please. Look at that. Is it because we had a level design in our Mallard Hunt? Is it because we had those story? Is that what it was? <laughs> Awesome. Watch the dough pile in. Oh, yeah. You have more than one million in cash and you'll be able to move on to the next level. This might sound like a lot, but don't worry. Once you release a hit, no, I think we just did. But then a Sega, not Sega, creator of the Master V console, has announced the not Sega gear. <laughs> Who has a color screen, but also uses like 20 batteries and it lasts like five minutes. <laughs> right. Keep that in mind. So kids. there's that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we're gonna make a lot of money. I bet we'll hit a million. With two we just tens. might have in two tens. Yeah. yeah. That's gonna be a hit. Mallard Hunt. <laughs> Yay! 100,000 units sold. Damn right. Hunting in action, it's great. Dialogue's Dialogue. not important. No. Engine's very important. We did good. We did. Let's do marketing. Awesome. You've made it quite a name for yourself and have saved up a lot of capital. If you want to grow the company, a uh, new office is next up. I found the perfect one. Yeah, let's move. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> and we have to hire an employee soon. Welcome to your new office. Now that you have a bigger office, you can also hire staff. I'm staff. I'm staff. And forge a <laughs> world-class development team to make even better games. Our computer looks very uh, 90s. Yes, it does. Golden chest and the boss is that way. That's cute. <laughs> Mini boss. Yeah. The Sega Gear has been released. Battery cells have skyrocketed. Well, <laughs> game history. No. I can't, Staff list. I can't research. There wasn't anything else to research, I don't think. I think so. That's just a staff list. I think we have to hire someone else. Oh, position. fill position. You have to complete the staff management training before you can hire someone. Simply click on their player character. Train. Staff management. Taking his online modules. Mm -hmm. We've all had to do it. Sold 1.5 million. Yeah. Well done. You're unable to hire your uh, first employee. What should we do? Game demo. I want to see what they can do. We won't be that picky. We'll just gr let them grow with the company. Yeah. Jennifer Peters. Colin McKinney. He's level two. Her research is more. And her speed is more. And her salary is less. Less experience, I'd hire but her. We'll, we'll grow with her. There we go. Medium games. Now we research. 
We are out of RP. Oh, uh, okay. So. Train? Uh, we can train during making games. Nintendo 64. Oh, no, that's. No, uh, that's different. That's the Commodore, Commodore 64. Never mind. I thought it was announcing the Nintendo 64, and I was make, super excited. How did I make a new game? Oh, yeah, I clicked the computer. I was clicking myself. My bad. Uh, develop new game. Let's get her going, get her started. Let's, let's do uh, sports, I guess. Everyone. Action. Or casual. Uh, Casual's new. I don't think with sports, though. T-E-S, yes. And we could do like, um, like extreme beach volleyball. Super beach. But we don't have a Super Nintendo yet. We're fine. Unless you want the sequel to be Super Duper Beach Volleyball. There you go. Super and that duper. would work. Yeah. <laughs> the Super sounds cool. It does. That's why Nintendo did it. So, engines the most. It's not three, so we'll just leave it right there. Three, I'd say, put it on the very bottom. Both yeah, two, that. that looks good to me. Yeah. That's the weird thing I'm going with. The mouse should almost be ready if you want to. Oh, it's okay. <coughs> I don't need to control anything. to train her because she's in the red? Uh, no, they, I think Bubbles her, aren't coming from her head. I think her bar just fills up eventually. I don't know. I forgot. She's, uh, you know, pretending that she's working. <laughs> totally. Oh, Commodore Aww. filed for bankruptcy. Sorry, Commodore. Boss, I've discovered that some really dedicated fans of Mallard Hunt have created a fan game using a lot of the material from our game. They don't make any money with it and just seem to do it for fun. Uh, let them be. I would let them be. I'm not going to be a, a dick about it. Yeah. AKA, I won't, I won't pull a Nintendo on them. Right. Cease and desist. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, we're back to mediocr mediocrity. Is that the right word? Mediocracy. Mediocracy. Maybe. Normalcy. Norm well, sevens are all the way across. That really is good, though. That's quite average and good. I'll take it. I'll take it. It'll make us some money. Yep. Aw. Our legal department's Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> we gained oh, fans. Oh, we gained fans. Game design for pirates? I like that one. Effect is unknown. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that game will make us a little bit of money. Better than nothing. Game report. Graphics is very important. Topic, audience, match, sports, everyone is great. Nice. Do we need to research? Is there anything we can research? Yeah, level editor. I don't think we have to do that because I think uh, I think I have like a mod or something where the, your employees will get experience when they develop games too, which is cool. So we can just focus on that, just making games. Oh, I didn't know you had any mods. I, th I thought I did. Could be wrong. I think that bar when it gets to the very bottom and then you go on vacation or something. Yeah, I remember. Is that right? Yeah. Is he 
you done? He's done. Let's pick a different topic we haven't done before. Uh, I guess we have done everything before. You want to do history again? Yeah. Casual? Oh, I don't know if history and casual go well together. Well, we'll go with casual. Rhythm? Yeah. Bongo Master. Nice. I was thinking of that game we used to play, that the, the Tonko Drum. Yeah, Tonko Drum Master. Yeah. I loved that game. That's what I was thinking of. All right, Jennifer, let's make Bongo Master. Uh, gameplay? Definitely. Not much story in Bongo Master. Volleyball made 200,000. That's not bad. Uh, yeah. Level design? Yep. Well, AI's got to be really important, too. Both. Yeah. Come on, Bongo Master. Uh, mono sounds. Sounds gotta be important, right? Mm -hmm. Graphics. I'm surprised we don't know much about this. It's our first casual game. That's oh, probably it is. why. Uh, we may bomb this then. We'll see. After we have those three learned, we should make a new engine. Isn't this a little early for open world? I guess Final Fantasy, I guess, type games. I guess that's considered open world back in the day. Bongo Master. Come on. Hey. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. I'll take that eight. We did something right. Awesome. Not, not bad. Not bad. I saw a couple of tens. Come on, ten. Come, come on, ten. On. Oh. Hey. I'll still take it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Awesome. Not bad. I wonder if she can do the report. I think so. You research open world. I need to start, uh, you know, delegating my duties. Yep. I think we make enough. I would hire one more person. You have to be careful with that. Once we do medium-sized gains, then you need to get more people. Okay. The gains we've been making, you don't really need. Whoa. Whoa. AI is not important at all. Okay. All right. We'll keep that in mind for the future. Research. 3D graphics. Ooh. Let's do medium games first, though, because that, that will take yeah. full advantage of our employees. Yeah. What can she do to research to get more points? I think you have to develop the game engine over and over again to get the points, which is really expensive. Mm -hmm. I guess we can go ahead and you start doing it. So we have a couple things to do. And that'll, that'll get us some research points. Okay. And we'll call it... Vroom Vroom Volume 2.0. <laughs> vroom Vroom 2.0. The stupidest name ever created. <laughs> Oh, about po I don't do potion contracts. I hardly ever do that. We can if you want to, but... I hardly ever do that either. I like to be my own publisher. Yeah. I think we're both... Yeah, the, the, the They want you to have a new topic. Yeah, the team are, is working together. That, yep. that, that's automatic. So you do create the entrance quicker. Oh, look at that. That's the uh, Genesis. Ooh, yes. Coming up. Yeah. So we should get the Super Nintendo soon. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. That's going to be great. Mm -hmm. Bongo Master made $350,000. We're getting, we're hovering around a million still. We're doing okay, but we need to... The engine costs quite a bit of money. That's okay, though. We'll do... Uh, we have to do a new topic, right? Yeah. 
School? Alternate History, Thief. I guess we can try School. And then she can research crap. Well. Yeah, have her do a topic too. Maybe Hospital? Oh, yeah. That way she's not just sitting there with her, you know, sitting on her bum. <laughs> I used to love, like, uh, what was that hospital game I used to play? Theme Hospital? No. Um, it was on the DS, and you got to, like, do surgery and stuff. Oh. I know what you're talking about. I loved that game. Christ, Christ, uh, Trauma Center? Was it Trauma Center? I think so. That sounds right. I liked, I liked the Theme Hospital by Bullfrog. That was a really fun game. Uh, let's develop a new game. Oh, medium. Ooh. But that'll take full advantage of everyone. Uh, everyone, uh, let's do hospital. For genre, we'll do simulation. And let's do, let's do a PC. Since yeah, let's do PC. Uh. Uh. Trauma center. That's a direct ripoff, though. Yeah, totally, huh? Um, Hospital. You could do emergency with an exclamation mark. <laughs> I was in like a hospital, like creator type game. Oh, I see. Hospital like maker. Building your hospital. Yeah. Okay. Don't have 3D graphics yet. Better user experience. That should hop out our cells. Mm -hmm. See, now you see your your staff and you can like, assign people. I remember doing that stuff. Yeah, see. One of them's got to do both. Two things. Oh, this is going to be challenging. We don't have enough people. One guy's gonna get burned out. Why were you saying earlier that you don't wanna have too many staff? It's just too expensive. Mm. You see where we're bleeding money over here. True. Yeah, see, they're already overworked. Yep. Maybe we shouldn't choose medium for a while. Yeah, we might need small games until we have more staff. Whoa. Whoa. They're really stretched. I have no clue what to do on this one make world design the most because it's a simulation and then graphics yeah and then sound works for me I might come back to Hondas that they're they're so uh, stretched yeah two people doing a medium game all by themselves mm. if we don't do that. Yeah. I'm a, little, I'm a little scared. But hey, 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 look at that. Hey! Whew. I was a little nervous on that one. Yeah. We took a risk. Whoa. Awesome. for a minute. <laughs> You've earned it. I think they come back on their own, don't they? Yeah. 
I never go on vacation. Hospital and simulation is a great combination. Nice. Yeah. We got some points. Cutscenes. But simple cutscenes. Yeah, but we haven't had any. <laughs> <laughs> To make us some money because we're getting a little low. Not too bad though. Better dialogues. And a topic. Oh. We're out of points. It's okay, we got a lot of topics last time. We still got stuff to do. That's true. Alright. What haven't we done? School? School. We'll do small again. Uh, like pers so, like persona, like persona, or? or 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 does it would it be like a learning game? I guess we make it like learning. Or would that be a adventure? Yeah. Or casual. I think adventure for school. We had to buy uh, a license for that, so I'm not sure if I want to do that. Let's just stick with. It says adventure. No. Is ours adventure? Yeah. Maybe we could do... PC. PC? Yeah. What do you want to call it? Hmm. We could do... You could do like New York City High or something like that and like huh? like make it like a really story based game. What do you think? No. I'm not sure how zombies would I think that's its own genre. Carmen San Diego. Well, since that's a ripoff, maybe you could do Carmen San Jose. <laughs> you got an achievement. <laughs> <laughs> Naming games is hard. <laughs> Carmen San Jose. Words are hard. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's very true. I've had a hard time naming my games. Okay, story and quest has to be number one. And gameplay. And gameplay. And then we can tone down just a tad. Yeah. <laughs> Dialogue way, way up. And AI. And AI. Carmen San Jose. <laughs> Good? Yep. We're taking a risk. We make a lot of games that we haven't done before. Hospital Maker made a million. A million. Dollars. Wow, not bad. But we're still hovering around a million. So it's. We're doing good. We need another hit. Hey. They like Carmen they San like Jose. They like Carmen San Jose. <laughs> we got ten. a 10. A masterpiece. Oh my gosh. Two 10s. Come on, two 10s. We're going to make some money now. Come on, come on, come on. Well, three three tens. tens. Wow. Come on, Star Games. What's your, what's your hold up? Awesome. People like Carmen San Jose. <laughs> now we can probably build a new game engine with all that money we're about to make. You can research. Not enough RP. 
Let's do the new, new game engine because we have like some stuff we have to do. So let's do um three D graphics, simple cutscenes, better dialogues. So we have some stuff to do. Yep. Vroom vroom three point oh. <laughs> <laughs> no vroom vroom three D. Get it? Oh like, get it? Yeah. Mm. I see what you did there. But now we're going to simplify it. It's like we're marketing Vroom 3D. <laughs> <laughs> I can see that being a thing. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Ooh, it's one of the rare games that will set new quality standards. <laughs> oh it's my always, goodness. It's, like, it's always those stupid it's the games. the unexpected ones. I know. That yes. we can't, yeah. Oh, oh Super, Super Nintendo. Nintendo. That's a cool looking Super Nintendo. I like the red buttons. Yeah. It's the greatest console we've ever built. The State of the art. 16-bit 16 graphics. Bit graphics. Mm-hmm. Simply we're, we're, super. We're going to name all of our games super now. Super. Super. Except Super Beach Volleyball is going to have to be Super Duper super Beach duper. Volleyball. <laughs> super Carmen San Jose. <laughs> Super Bam Margera Rehab Skater. <laughs> That's going to be our next game. Let's go back and make Bam Margera right. Super, super. <laughs> Definitely. All right, hold on. We got to research this first. Well, we got $3 million. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. We made 2.5 mil. Awesome. Games don't see the market very long in this point of the game. Uh, Vroom 3D. I like that. Me too. Okay, so... Wait, can we... Um, how do we do a new system? Or was the SNES not out yet? Just talked about. I think it's just talked about. Oh, okay. So let's do... Uh, Super Bam Margera. We uh, have skater. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I spelled it wrong. <laughs> okay, topic. Extreme sports. Extreme sports. <laughs> <laughs> Action. Sports is good for this. NES. Right? Mm -hmm. Vroom, Vroom 3D, 3D on Nintendo. Oh yeah. Is it, should it be mature? Oh my gosh, no. No. I don't think it would do well. No, it wouldn't sell very well right now on this stage of the game. We can do 3D graphics. 3D graphics. Or should we make it? We make a 2D version too. That might be better quality. That's true. It is NES for God's sakes. Right. <laughs> oh, just, oh, oh, now it comes timing. out. Bad timing. That's okay. We can make super duper Bam Margera Rehab Skater. <laughs> <laughs> Needs a good engine. Good gameplay. Story quest. We can go down there. Yep. He has no story. He just kicks ass. <laughs> he usually breaks his ass. Right. Better dialogues. Hey, AI all the way up. Perfect. Last time we bombed this, but now we learn from our past we mistakes. Mm -hmm. Super Ban Margera Rehab Skater is going to be great. <laughs> it's going to be a hit. <laughs> Get those bugs out first. Fingers crossed. You rarely, rarely will release a game with a masterpiece back to back in this game. True. It's like the game hates you. Don't expect too much greatness after a big hit. Pay raise. Good for you, Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> Super Band Margera Rehab Skater has now came in. I told you. Aww. Bam's just cursed. A oh. uh, three? Oh, we bombed it. Aww. No one likes Bam. Dang Not it. bad. Not good. <laughs> we'll try again later. <laughs> <laughs> In the future, we'll, we'll make it work eventually, Bam. I promise. I promise. We'll get eventually, it right. we will get it. <laughs> Can't do that one yet. Almost. Extreme sports, oh. everyone bad. Oh, so maybe I should have made it mature. Huh. I told you we should have made it mature. Huh. But you never listened to me. Sorry. It's okay. 
It said up at the top that a strong audience right now is young. So maybe we could do. Hmm. And do aliens again? For young? Yeah. Okay. We'll call it. Uh. <laughs> Were you going to do probe? Space. <laughs> Super space probe. <laughs> the genre will be. You want to do RPG again? Uh, for young, is that okay? You think? I don't think so. Why not? Okay. Super NES. Yes. Yeah, I'll definitely play that. Pay that. Vroom 3D. You ready? Ready. We'll make it 3D. Because 3 is cool. Yes, it is. All the kids like 3D. Oh, God, we have no idea what to do here. Um, I would put story and quest as the highest since it's an RPG, then gameplay, then engine. Yeah. Works for me. Is there a pause button on this for laundry? For laundry? There's yes. no laundry. I think the game's kind of, in a way, paused right now. Okay, cool. So, go for it. I forgot what we were doing. S super space probe. What was that? <laughs> oh, I'm on drugs. <laughs> Our uh, alien RPG. Okay. Hey, Sony's in development. Oh, they're PS1. Remember, they, okay. they were originally working with Nintendo, and, and the plan fell through. Because gotcha. they were going to make a CD player for Nintendo. Yeah, the first, the world's first CD drive. Uh-oh, things turn sour. Uh-oh. Oh. The PS1's my favorite system of all time, so I'll definitely have to make something for that. Uh, world design's important. Sound's important, too, so I guess I'll just do a little bit of everything. That sounds good. Maybe this, maybe Super Space Pro will do better than Bam Margera. Rehab Skater. Rehab Skater. <laughs> <laughs> we'll make it work one of these days. That's, That's right. One of these days. We learned that kids don't like it. It's mostly adults, which, which makes sense. It makes it's, sense. It's Bam Margera. <laughs> Super Space Pro is doing pretty dang good. Awesome. Come on, come on, come on, come on. What? There's Fortin with the tens here. Awesome. Just couldn't okay. get enough. Oh, 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 oh. Awesome. Yeah, that guy really liked it. All right. Research character progression. Sure. Um, what? Oh. <laughs> oh. We probably shouldn't do that. Uh, that's mean. That's mean. Super Bam Margera Rehab Skater. Hey, it made some money. Hey, almost a hundred grand. Look at that. Port. What should we do? Research. New, New topic. We could do alternate history. TS no longer supported. Wow, eight games. Oh, cool. And a total of 3.4 million. Yeah, we have $3 million. Let's hire one more person. Sure. Maybe do some middle, medium budget. Let's do sh show real. Two people. 
people. Ooh, that, person, that person's really good. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Let's Preston, hear him. Preston Daniel. All right, now let's do... Develop new game. We'll do medium now since we have a... He's still in the red, though. Sure, I guess we can do small for now. Let's do a small, yeah. So we're doing alternate history? Totally. What would be good for that? Strategy? No. RPG, maybe? RPG, yeah. Super Nintendo. Okay. And it's alternate history, so... Mm -hmm. If RPG is good for that, yeah, maybe yeah. action. Maybe action. So, are you thinking like a like a side scroller beat em up? Zombies at the Alamo. There you go. I think everyone's okay with that for for a rating. Well, we could do our first mature game. Make it have blood. Yeah, make it gory. Okay, engine highest. That one there and that one low. Nice. That looks good to me. Yeah, we had that good already game off the market. Super Space Probe. Nice. Um, Graphics the best. Yep. Sure. Cool. Let's do it. He's like, wow, you're actually making a mature game? According to the interview company, uh, is working on its first game targeted at mature players. John Doe, owner and CEO of Joystick Studios said, we think that players are looking for more mature content in games and we are willing to take a risk to give it to them. Many industry experts say that sooner or later, games with mature themes will become more common. We are curious to see how the market will react to these games. We are too. It may bomb. Ooh, tons of level ups. And better AI. I think Jennifer needs to go on vacation. I think so. Both of them. Even though he just started here. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it's not going to be... Just because you're doing something new doesn't mean it's going to be a success. That's true. People don't like zombies at the Alamo. <laughs> What's, uh, I guess he can't. I think he needs to train or something since he's like brand new. I think so. Takes a while to get used to the new job, I guess. Yeah. It's a good, com good combination. Uh, Gameplay is important. Oh, mature is oh, bad. Oh, okay. They just didn't like the, the ranking. Target audience. Okay. Fine. Have we not done something yet? We could do a mythology. Um, we haven't done one on the Super Nintendo. Sure. Maybe adventure. 
Adventure wasn't good on. This is any combo. Okay, okay combo. combo. Simulation. That's all we know. Let's do action. Super Nintendo. Okay. And we could do. Called Thor. Okay. <laughs> That's the best I can think of right now. <laughs> that last game was depressing. It was. No one liked it. Nope. It hurt. I blame Jennifer. It's her fault. <laughs> Good. I wonder if it's time for a new engine yet. Didn't sell much. Four is ready. That's our most uninspired <laughs> game yet. And watch it get all tens. Multiplayer. Multiplayer begin. Mm -hmm. Eh. Cool. Better, better than bombing. It is. Yeah, pretty good. Maybe it's time for a new engine. I think so. And then we can make super duper beach volleyball. There you go. Some engine, character progression, better AI. Multiplayer was up top. Oh, I thought I saw multiplayer somewhere. There it oh, is. there it is. I went too fast. So three new things. We'll call it Vroom. Like IV. Vroom multiplayer. Oh, okay. There we go. Got to make it, you know, relevant. Well, see, I wanted it to be four, but changing up the naming structure like Xbox. <laughs> so it'd be like Vroom 360. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and then Vroom X. <laughs> Vroom X. <laughs> OG3. Nice. We don't have the money for that type of stuff, though. I mean, we'll, we'll like participate like minimally. Yeah, a small booth. Yeah, we're not rich yet. Later in the game, I just start like I go every year and spend like massive amounts oh, of me too. stupid money. Yes. Nice. Four hundred, not bad. We will make a multiplayer game. Awesome. Now we can do multiplayer super duper beach volleyball. <laughs> okay, so to do that, it's at uh, sports, right? Mm -hmm. And then action. action. Platform will do Super Nintendo. Nintendo. And then uh, multiplayer. We'll call it a super duper beach volleyball. <laughs> Everyone. Great combo. Look at that. No 3D? Uh that's like this is like the good looking 2D stuff. It's like the best. Oh, okay. Character progression. Looks good. Looks good. We're gonna make a hit, dang it. 
my god, this is gonna be a good one. <laughs> Better AI, look at that. That right there is gonna make it a hit. Yep. Good. That nah, small booth, fine. Sure. Uh oh. <laughs> Warn him. It's not our best title, so I don't. I really don't care. <laughs> <laughs> That's four. Our most original title yet. Super duper beach volleyball. Come on, tins. Yay. More, please. Ooh, can't wait nice. for the sequel. Nice. Super duper, duper duper <laughs> beach volleyball. Awesome. That'll give us some money. I like money. <laughs> Piracy is increasing. Some fans. Game report. I'll have her do it. She ain't doing anything. <laughs> oh, ran out of points. <laughs> Super duper beach volleyball. <laughs> like one guy showed up. I want to play this. Oh, wow. That's nice. awesome. <laughs> Dialogue's Ooh. not very important. PS1. 32-bit processor. We're going to have to make a PS1 game. Sequels. Oh, we can't do a new topic. Just old topics. Want to do another rhythm game? Sure. Casual or? Okay. Oh yeah, PS1's not out yet. We'll call it Cotton Eye Joe. That's a dance. <laughs> That's going to be a big seller right there. <laughs> Everybody wants to play that game. <laughs> oh, I sure as hell do. <laughs> Where'd you even come up with that? I was thinking of dances. <laughs> <laughs> it's the dance they always play at, at the dances in Archtown. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, this is Gary with Gamers. I got word that Joystick Studios is working on a new game. Would you be willing to share some information? Uh, I, I suppose. I suppose. What is your expectation? Hype it. Totally. Everybody wants to play Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, take away some AI. Yeah. A lot of it. Needs level design, right? Mm-hmm. Last time we bombed that bad. Yeah. Hey, PS1, that'll be our next game. Definitely. Maybe it'll let us research a topic and maybe we'll get like horror or fantasy or something. Yeah. That'd be cool. Come on, Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> I have faith. That's it. That's going to be our next... Um, Ooh, stereo sound. Score of 10. If this is a perfect 10s, I'm going to laugh. <laughs> hey, we got nines. <laughs> Not bad. 
Screw you, informed gamer. Cotton Eye Joe's a masterpiece. <laughs> you just don't know it. <laughs> Good game. Okay. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Sequels, that'd be cool. You can go home. You're not doing anything, anyways. Yeah. <laughs> Piss off. Uber, Uber successful. successful. Nice. Nice. Help so we yourself. did good. Yeah. We do now. If you do train, will you get uh, research points so we can do new topics? You can do that, or you also can. Uh, or do a contract work. Or build. Or a publishing deal. That's okay. Well, it comes naturally. You want to develop a sequel? Sure. Let's go back to like the, our roots. Let's make it better civilized. We can do better than that. Okay. Civilized two. And everyone, history, great combo, pick platform. Let's make it for PS1. Ooh, 200,000. Game engine, vroom multiplayer. Let's do it, babe. Let's make civilized cool. Okay. We got this. That looks good. everything we've learned. <laughs> uh, AI's got to be huge because of yeah. the other players. Simulation. Mm -hmm. It's got to be really huge. That's probably why I bombed last time. What was I thinking? Yeah. A simulation? AI is going to be big. You would think. Mm hmm. That yeah, looks good. How much did Cotton Eye Joe make? Almost a million. Wow. Not bad, Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> the sequel that no one asked for. Yay! And by God, we delivered. Yay! Got a 10. Awesome. I'm trying to make our, our hit franchise. Yes. Cool. And port. We have a lot of research points now, so let's research day and night cycle or a new topic? New topic. Sci-fi? Sci-fi. We need to develop a new engine. We've have we've have uh, quite a few stuff. Cool. I like making sequels. Yeah, me too. All right, let's do a uh, new engine. Oh, that's all we have. Yeah, I don't have that much yeah. that's too much money. Just Not to... worth half a million. Yeah. Let's develop a sequel to most of our games. Kind of suck. Carmen San Jose did really well. Mallard Hunt was our big success. Oh, yeah. Mallard Hunt was a big one. Let's do that one. Yeah. And we'll Super Mallard Hunt for the SNES. And make it multiplayer. How do you do that? It's in the next screen, I think. It is? I think.
I haven't seen the option. Usually, like, multiplayer is, like, later on down the road. Maybe it is later on. Oh, no, I mean, we've done it before, but it's, like... Down the road. Over there. Yeah, multiplayer is yeah, on. It's enabled. Cool. Fine, adjust. That's the cool about the sequels is that it's, you get the hints. Yes. But if you do a sequel too soon, people are like, this is boring. Yeah, we just had one of these. <laughs> yeah. That looks better, I think. This could be a hit. Uh, Graphics all the way up. All the way up. Let's give the people what they want. No. No. Too shady for me. Too shady. I love in um, that Caesar's Palace game how, like, sometimes a guy will come up to you and be like, uh, do you want to buy this watch? You know, <laughs> like, you have all kinds of shady propositions. Right. Uh-oh. Like Mallard Hunt. I like it. Meh. Meh. It has its moments. Wasn't the hit like the last one was. Darn. It happens. Sometimes like, there's like there's like variables, like people aren't into that certain combination of stuff right now. Yeah. Still need, oh, prison. That's cool. We still haven't done a game for uh, sci fi yet. Oh, yeah. We should. Whoa. So, new game. Sci fi. Sci -fi. Action. PS1. For a multiplayer. And you could do Spider Bro instead of Spider Man. Dash. Spider Bro. <laughs> Does that sound okay? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Come on, Spider Bro. Mmm, <laughs> yeah, looks good to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tone that down. I guess three dashes should make it all the way down. Mm hmm. Still don't know about this one. Hey, we have more than last time. Got more fans. On Spider Bro. I have faith. Come on, Tim. That was all over the place. We're from like 10 to 3. Yeah. Ooh, I even saw a 1 in there. Jeez. Meh. Not a fan of Spider Bro. Sci fi combination might not be good with action. Oh, maybe not. They make those a lot. Ooh. Our RP, is, that's expensive. Uh, mm -hmm. That'd be good for like a role-playing game. Ooh. 
sci-fi. It's a great combination. Gameplay is important. It just, it just didn't work. <laughs> uh, maybe we should start Day one, you do a medium. Uh, let's do one more game, then we'll call it for tonight. Yeah, we gotta watch the new Roadhouse. <laughs> yeah, totally. Let's do, let's make a prison um, simulation builder game, and we'll call it Shawshank. <laughs> Shawshank. I spell that right? Uh huh. Developer or dev? <laughs> Tycoon. There you go. Make it a medium. Shawshank Tycoon. There you go. Uh. Since it's prison, should we do mature? No, it's okay. You just build a prison. It's not a big deal. But I guess it could. Oh, okay. I guess it could be. That should be fine. I mean, you're not shanking anybody. <laughs> That's we'll, true. We'll see, though. I guess the Strong Alliance is young right now, so maybe we should have profited off of that. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's good. What do you think? Artificial intelligence? Level design? That looks good to me. I'll make him do more of the last phase. Mm -hmm. A lot of research. That's good. Yeah. Well, uh... Graphics to you. Well, we have 300 in design. It should be us. Okay. Well, we're we're kind of stretched thin here. True. Spider Bros suck. Not making a sequel to that. Dumpster. Still made two hundred eighty-two thousand dollars, but yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Final game of the evening. Hopefully, it's not a you know a turd. <laughs> it stinks. <laughs> it stinks. Fun, kind of. Oh, 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 oh. no. Do we choose a bad, a bad combination, maybe? Mm. Ouch. Maybe it should have been mature and on the PC. Yeah. That one was a dud. Darn. You can't always win. That's Stereo true. sound. Ooh. finish this and call it a night. I had a lot of fun playing this with you. Me too. It's a totally chill game. A very chill game. Let's see where we went wrong. Good combination. Story is not very important. Hmm. It doesn't seem like we made any huge mistakes. It just wasn't we in the cards, did. just wasn't resin. That's how this game works. Sometimes you can you can do all things perfect. It's just sometimes it just doesn't do well. It's Which just, happens in real life. Yeah, it's just kind of random. You know, it happens. Yeah. So yeah, thanks for all watching. Right. Uh, we'll definitely play more of this game later. Yep.